Hi, thanks for being here today, and thank you to all the people who left early that I could speak. Um, appreciate that. I have a whole lot to say, um, and it certainly wouldn't fit into three minutes, so I'll be sending my written comments as well. But I do want to make a couple points. There are a lot of things about this pipeline that concern every single one of us in this room, and obviously with the turnout you can see such a concern. I'm concerned about a few things. We know it's not in the national interest. We know this oil is not guaranteed to go to anyone in this country except what you spill on our land. I want to tell you a little bit about myself. My name's Susan. I was born here in Lincoln, still live here in Lincoln, was gone a couple years, but pretty much I'm a Nebraskan all the way through my heart. Um, both sides of my family came here over 100 years ago to Nebraska. We've been in the Midwest a lot longer than that and in the States a lot longer than that. My grandmother came to this country in a covered wagon, came to this state in a covered wagon. She didn't need oil. And I'm now a grandmother who is fighting to make sure that the water stays clean for every generation to come, and not just my own granddaughter, but for everybody in this room. Yeah. I also want to thank the unions for busting in people, and even the people who came in here from Illinois and Iowa and Nevada that we've had the pleasure of meeting today, because you've proven the point that not all these jobs are going to go to Nebraskans, are not going to go to Lincoln people. And I can tell you Nebraskans are some of the most decent folks I've ever known that you can find anywhere on this planet. Americans are some of the most decent folks you're going to find on this planet. We're desperate for jobs. Even I'm desperate for a job. But I don't think any of us are willing to sacrifice American lives and American livelihoods for a job, temporary or permanent. We need to come up with solutions, but this pipeline is not the solution. And I'm really, honestly, upset. I'm an American citizen. I expect my American government to be protecting me and my fresh water, not me having to come here and beg you to protect me from a foreign company that wants to put a pipeline in my drinking water. Do the right thing. Deny the right thing. Deny the pipeline.